When it comes to buying a car, most customers don't primarily attach importance to speed because fast cars are obviously expensive. However, some of them still do some research on fast cars and try to stand updated about them. In this video, I'm going to present you, people who don't necessarily investigate fast cars, top 10 currently the fastest cars in the world. Before we get into that, the speed unit I'm going to be using is kilometers per hour, but keep in mind miles per hour is going to be shown on the screen too. Number 10, we got the Tesla Roadster. This car was revealed as a surprise at the end of the Tesla Semi unveiling. Roadster features the most impressive specification sheet of any EY, which means electronic vehicle by the way. Tesla Roadster's maximum speed is claimed to be 402 km per hour, but that is not the only feature making it a great car. Roadster is in a class of its own with its acceleration. According to the tests, it can go from 0 to 98 km per hour in 1.9 seconds and it can go from 0 to 161 km per hour in just 4.2 seconds. It also offers a 998 km range on a single charge. When it comes to its price, the Tesla Roadster is expected to retail for $200,000 as a base price and it is set to be coming out at 2020. And the number 9, we have Aston Martin Valkyrie. It is an hybrid electronic sports car, which was produced in 2018. Valkyrie is built by collaboration of Aston Martin and Red Bull Race. Inner Calerily, one of the developers was Formula One genius Adrian Newey. Therefore, this car with a code name Nebula was designed with the most aggressive aerodynamics and many of the techniques used in professional racing. It is claimed that Aston Martin Walkery can go 402 km per hour and this claim is on road car version of it which is going to be 3.2 million dollars. It is also said that the track version with only 25 units is going to be around 4 million dollars with a specific name Aston Martin Walkery AMR Pro. At the number 8, we have a car manufacturer most of you probably have never heard about. SSC North America is a hypercar manufacturer that specializes in limited production vehicles like SSC Ultimate Aero XT. This car held the title of the fastest car in the world in 2007 until 2010 when its opponent came back which I'm going to present at one of the upcoming rankings. It was officially timed at 412 km per hour by Guinness World Records. SSC Ultimate Aero XT was introduced to the world with only 5 units with the price changing from $750,000 to $850,000. The reason for that difference is SSC's new graduated pricing system that entices customers to get their orders early. At the number 7, we have an electric car again and it's Rimac Concept 2. The supercar is a semi-autonomous car, which means it is capable of sensing its environment and moving with little or no human input. Rimac Concept 2 is claimed to be capable of reaching 415 km per hour at most. Another impressive feature of the car is its acceleration. The 1914 horsepower can purportedly propel the car from 0 to 98 km per hour in just 1.85 seconds and making it one of the fastest accelerating cars. While advertising 648 km range on a single charge, it seems like the average sticker of 150 units is about 2.7 million dollars. Number 6 is a car of a brand known for manufacturing fast supercars, Bugatti Chiron was developed in France as a successor to Bugatti Veyron. It made its debut at 2016 and it took the torch from Bugatti Veyron by hitting 420 km per hour and stayed fast until its brother's sport versions rise. Like its predecessor, the Veyron, Chiron utilizes a carbon fiber body structure and worth millions. The Chiron is limited to a series of 500 units and a price around $3 million.
Number 5. We have another Bugatti supercar and it is the car which lost its ranking to SSC Ultimate Aero XT in 2007. And its original version lost the title of being the fastest Bugatti to its brother Bugatti Chiron in 2016. However, this car has a version called Bugatti Veyron Super Sport, which hit 431 km per hour in 2010 and stands faster than both of these cars. Nevertheless, it is an electronically limited to 415 km per hour to protect the tires from disintegrating. Production cars were limited to 30 units and the world record Super Sport was limited to only 5 units with a price tag of $1.7 million. Fourth fastest car is a pretty known one among car lovers because its manufacturer have been doing pretty well at building sport cars. The Hennessy Renham GT is a high performance sports car manufactured by Texas based Hennessy Wenham Engineering. Because of its hand built nature, there is some debate about whether the Wenham GT qualifies as a production car. This monster recorded a 435 km per hour run at the Kennedy Space Center in 2014, but only in one direction. To be considered legitimate, record attempts usually require a run in each direction, and an average is taken into account for wind conditions. As the run was in a single direction and only 13 cars have been sold to date, it does not qualify as the world's fastest production car in the Guinness Book of Records. To qualify for Guinness World Records, NSA must have built 30 units back in time. Lastly, this record-breaking sport car's price is currently $1.2 million. We are at the top 3. And the third fastest car in the world is Koenigsegg Agera RS. In 2017, the Nevada Department of Transportation closed an 11-mile stretch of road just outside Las Vegas. Swedish supercar hit two different speeds, which averaged out to 447 km per hour. There are only 25 Agera RS models in existence, and each owner works alongside Koenigsegg to personalize every detail from color, stitching, engine power output, and car nickname. This lightweight hypercar has a carbon fiber body and costs $2.5 million. At the number 2, we have a SSC car again, which is the predecessor of the number 8 SSC Ultimate Aero XT. The SSC Tuatara is an upcoming American sports car. Its pre-production prototype was shown to world in 2011, and it is said that it is going to be available in 2019. SSC Tuatara's top speed is 482.2 km which is making it much faster than its opponents and just a little bit slower than the number one. However, this top speed is a claimed number just like its rival. Number 1. Hennessy Wenham F5 Another Hennessy supercar making it up to top 5 and technically the fastest car in the world right now. The maximum speed of this car is a claimed number like SSC Tuatara's speed. So the only question remaining is whether F5 or Tuatara will hit the 30 miles per hour milestone first, which is 482.2 kilometers per hour by the way. According to the tests done by the manufacturer Hennessy, this monster can hit 484.4 km per hour. The F5 name is a reference to F5 Tornado, which is the fastest tornado in Fujita scale, capable of upraising strong frame houses and carrying considerable distance to disintegrate. The Hennessy Wenham F5 was unveiled at the SEMA show in Las Vegas, Nevada on November 1, 2017. It is expected to be available in 2019 with 24 units and $1.6 million prize. To conclude, Hennessy Wenham F5 and SSC Tuatara have yet to confirm their top speed with the Guinness Book of World Records, so the Koenigsegg Agera RS remains the official fastest car in the world for now. And this is the full list of the cars so that you can envision it easier when you need it, or you can simply watch the video again. Before ending this video, do not forget to subscribe to my channel.
turn the bell button on and like this video. See you in the next video.